You may know that Channel 2 has been an advocate for teen athletes for years. Our Bill Spencer, who leads our Spencer Solves a Team, pushed really hard for free in-depth heart screenings. Well, now it's become a state law. And he's also helped organize heart screening events all across our area. Two more, by the way, planned in the coming weeks. Bill will tell us about those in just a moment. But first, a little reminder of why these screenings are so important. down slow pop up aggressively at 16 years old Stratford High nice. School student Adrian nice. story is constantly nice. working on improving on, his bud. speed and his footwork because as a catcher for the Adidas Brewer nice Baseball moving, Club man. speed and agility are critical I push myself pretty hard but as strong and powerful as he looks on the outside on the inside and go. Adrian had a ticking Keep time bomb beating in his chest a hidden heart defect no one knew he had until last August, when right in the middle of running a series of wind sprints, Adrian suffered sudden cardiac arrest. I got back to the line, I put my hands on my knees, and suddenly, like, just everything just went white, like bright light and stuff. Adrian's teacher performed CPR, and within minutes, Adrian appeared to be fine. His parents took him to a doctor who cleared him to go home, but less than two days later, Adrian collapsed once again. I had been told that I had had a cardiac arrest. Over three days, I died twice, essentially. Now, to protect your children from ever having to go through what Adrian's been through, we at KPRC are teaming up with the Cody Stevens Foundation, the Memorial Athletic Club, Rock Sports and Spine, the Parisi Speed School, Berkeley Eye Center, and River Oaks Paint and Body to provide all student athletes 11 to 25 with a totally free in-depth heart screening that can detect hidden heart defects a normal sports exam can't find. Sudden cardiac arrest is the number one cause of death in student athletes. Randy Hartley, a member of Bill's Brigade, is donating $2,000 to fund the event. What we're trying to protect here is lives. To be able to save a life, there's no words that can describe it for me. And Dave and Joyce Cardone are hosting this screening at the Memorial Athletic Club so we can find kids who are at risk before it's too late. If it's discoverable, why aren't we discovering it? Let's get him in here and see how we can help him. Stay in tall. As stay for tall, Adrian, he's back to playing stay competitive tall. baseball, aiming smooth. to play in college, nice and he knows what is at stake for every young athlete who is not tested in this way. Your life is at stake, obviously. Um, this, you never, you, this could happen to you any day. I got to tell you, Adrian was incredibly lucky. He suffered two heart attacks in just three days, but was able to be resuscitated both times. He had heart surgery and now is back to playing baseball better than ever. Now to get your children tested, we have two upcoming heart screens over the next two weeks. You need to take, a, take advantage of this. The first one is Sunday, July 28th at the Memorial Athletic Club from 11 o'clock until 3 o'clock. The next one is the Cameron Janelle heart screen, Saturday, August 3rd at the Pearland Recreation Center from 10 10 a.m. until 2 p.m. Both events are absolutely free, but you do need to register your kids in advance, and you can do that by going to clicktohouston.com. We have provided two links to these events where you can sign up in just seconds. Well, your work has led to a new state law. Congratulations. That's amazing. That's amazing. Great. It only took six years. Yeah. Six well, years. You finally got there. You saved some kids. You've provided some relief for parents. Yeah. So thank you, Bill. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Love it. Great. <laughs> Bill's the guy you want on your side if you've got any kind of an issue to reach the Spencer's solves it team or just join Bill's Brigade if you'd like to help out call 713-223-TIPS. You can also send an email to solves it at clicktohouston.com.